a new steel mill coming right here to Beaver County, right on the ground that we're standing on, and it's expected to bring hundreds of jobs with it. There's an old saying, that, hey, you think the mills are coming back? Um, you're wrong, but we were wrong because it's coming back, and it's a beautiful thing. A groundbreaking ceremony for a new steel mill. 72 Steel LLC is based out of Brooklyn, New York, and decided the steel city was where they wanted to plant next. Well, they've been looking for different places, so West Virginia, uh, go hell, maybe even North Carolina, and of course Pittsburgh. But they fall in love with Pittsburgh. Uh, they feel, of course, this is the capital of steel for the U.S. The roughly $200 million Chinese American investment will manufacture high quality rebar, utilizing low carbon steel, advanced steel production, and environmental protection technology. Cheyenne Chung says the infrastructure bill played a big role. Made in USA, and also we want to re revive the manufacturing you know, in this country. And the infrastructure bill also create a big gap, supply gap for steel. The 72 steel mill, which will sit where the former Jones and Lachlan Steel Corporation was here in Aliquippa, Beaver County, will bring over 300 jobs with it. And that's not including the hundreds of jobs it will offer during the building phase. It's a total of anywhere from three to 900 jobs that's laid down, that's construction. So I'm telling everybody in the county, everybody in the city, get ready. Get educated, get to these CCBC, CCACs, get educated, because we want you to drive in this tunnel. And the steel mill is projected to be finished by the end of 2025. Reporting from Beaver County, I'm Tori Yorgi for Pittsburgh's Action News 4.